Hello everyone. Uh, today I'm meeting up with Fiction, and we're gonna do another uh, sword fight video. Uh, we've been doing this a lot recently, and a lot of videos have been blowing up uh, on social media. So I started posting these fight videos on this YouTube channel as well, and people seem to enjoy it very much. So I thought it would be great to capture some behind the scenes and share with you guys. So, let's do this. Swaggy, like I don't overthink it. Yeah, we just we just let it flow. Like this is why I don't like to over choreograph before I get into in the thought process. I'll just try to finish. Okay, we didn't talk much to the camera, so I'll put a little bit of voiceover here and there to explain things. When we shot this, we were trying out dual sword style versus a single sword style for the first time. We roughly choreographed this a week ago, and now I'm trying to polish it before shooting. In front of the elevator. It would have been funny if somebody came out of the elevator and seen a sword fight. But apparently, nobody really comes up here to this top floor during the day. And even a security said it's okay to use this space as long as there's no people around. just started practicing in five minutes. Oh. And he wants to shoot already. I mean, we, one more time? <laughs> you want to shoot? We, mean, got we, you. we usually Alrighty. practice just five minutes and go ahead and shoot. Yes, we do. <laughs> That's the way I like to do. <laughs> Our best ones have been that. Which is crazy. The, the, the most viral one, it took us 10 minutes. We came yeah. up with it because we had to do it before Jam ended. Yeah, and Jam yeah, was yeah, ending yeah, in like 10 yeah. minutes. We boom, shot it, go. So that video got 65 million views. 65 million? It's insane. Yeah. That's nuts for 10 and, minutes. And of counting. Oh, like. uh, so this is what we have been using <laughs> recently. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's dead already, Toro. Yeah, this happens very often in LA. So these swords are made out of aluminum. They look amazing. They're perfect for, honestly, high budget movies and they're made by steven stunt ford check him out on instagram that's his instagram steven stunt ford um yeah they're amazing yeah we've been using some bamboo sword too but this looks even more real almost the same way too yes yes but always we have to be careful anyway always yeah no matter what bamboo still hurts okay let's do it okay you didn't say anything before you go. In the last fight, I died once. So I'm supposed to be kind of like making this comeback today. Trying to wear this mask if it's not too hot to hide my identity. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I think you can go like. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you pretend like, like, like you're pulling it out, like, so, so. Oh, like, like a boom, 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 thing. Shing. Boom, boom. Yes, do that. And action. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so we started shooting. The concept of this fight was Fiction doesn't know who he's fighting against until the end. As I mentioned, I supposedly died in the last fight. But maybe I didn't die or somebody used a Shenlong wish on me. So I'm making a comeback. Right now, we are just sort of testing out to see how it looks on camera. Because this is a one-er, meaning everything is shot in one take. It's crucial to rehearse well and see where the camera should be for each attack. 
Also, it's super important to have a videographer who can move fast to capture all different angles. This videographer needs to be well aware of the distance as well, not to get too close because we don't want to hit him with a sword, but at the same time, he needs to get close enough to get dynamic shots. I think it takes a different skill from regular film format shoot. Trusting people. <laughs> At some point, this covers my face like fully, so I really just have to trust fiction and swing the sword. This is angled so far. Yeah. <laughs> that looks dangerous. That looks dangerous. Bro. Yes. Ooh, not bad.
Okay, so we finished. How many takes do you think we did? Maybe... Uh, 15? 15? Yeah, we don't do it in one take, unfortunately. But every time we do more and more takes, we analyze and try to make it better. So, uh, I hope to do this thing more. Yeah. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.